Jesus is Lord. And I'm going to to Jesus save me. I'm going to save you. Jesus Christ will set anyone free. Repent and put your faith in Jesus Christ. Amen.
Amen. Our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. I used to be a porn addicted pervert and I got saved reading a Bible in jail. God gave me the Holy Spirit. God forgave me of all my wickedness. We're not praying in public, we're preaching. And he gave me the Holy Ghost. And the Bible says, Repent! This is preaching, not praying. This is preaching. That your sins might be blotted out. Are you not John 9 31. God doesn't hear the prayers of sinners. But if any man be a worshiper of God, him he hears. God doesn't hear your prayers. Because you agree with this. You agree with this filthiness. You're in big trouble with God. You better repent for God kills you. And he will give you the gift of the Holy Spirit. God gives you the Holy Spirit. You don't want to look at porn anymore. That's sick. That's perverted. That's evil. I hope that you can let go of all this hate. As the Lord says, hate what is evil. We want to take the And love what is good. You need a new heart. You need God to give you a new heart. Amen. He give he'll give you a new spirit. He'll show you mercy if you repent. If you follow Jesus. Amen. What does it mean to follow Jesus? Love thy neighbor. It means to love your neighbor. You're not loving your neighbor. You're not loving your neighbor. Telling them lies. That will send them to hell. That it's okay to be a homo. It's okay. Love is not sin. Love is not sodomy. Love is not two men with each other. Love is keeping the commandments of God. If you love your wife, if you love God, you won't commit adultery on your wife. If you love God, you won't be a homosexual. You'll be forgiven and set free. You'll have children, a godly seed. Yes, you've been deceived by the devil. You're going to hell first. Turn! Why are you still out breath in your lungs? Turn! From your evil ways! Before your sin finds you out. Your sin is going to find you out. Be sure that your sin will find you out. Be sure that the day of judgment is coming. <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus is the answer. Amen. Jesus is the only name given under heaven by which we must be saved. It's not in our lives, not a prayer. It's only through Jesus to Christ. You. From that home, oh, I came to a homicide for lifestyle. Read it! I believe it! LGBT. And obey it! Jesus said, Everyone who hears my word and believes on him who sent me will have eternal life and he, will, he has passed from death to life and he will not come into condemnation. You are condemned already in your sin. You are condemned already in your abomination. The only love that there is is from God. Every other love is a lie. Sodomy is not love. Sodomy is an abomination to God. You are deceived and Curse that sound maker in the name of Jesus. Destroy you. Distort it and blow it up in Jesus' name. God Curse it to the root in the name of Jesus. You, if you don't repent, in Psalm 5, 5, the Bible says, I don't want you to go to hell. I don't want you to go to hell. Love to you is love. It says that God hates the workers of iniquity in Psalm 5, 5. Love is not sexual perversion. 
right? Turn the cries! Jesus is coming back! He's flaming fire, the Bible says! To take vengeance! What caveats must I make? Against all those who do not know God and those who do not obey the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ, you're going to hell, man! That's Old Testament. Jesus can save you! Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Jesus came to save you from your pornography addiction. How do you sacrifice your goat? Jesus came and he bled on the cross. He was tortured. He shed his blood to wash you from your sin, to wash you from your homosexual spirit, to wash you from all your evil ways. The Bible says if we walk in the light as he is in the light, we have fellowship one with another. But it says if we walk in darkness, we lie and do not the truth. You're walking in lies. Curse of the Lord is on the house of the wicked. But the blessing of the Lord is on the house of the just. If you're queer, you can be queer no more. Jesus said, go and sin no more. And John 8, 11, you better believe the word. He will save you from your sin. I'm an ex friend. Wicked sinner trying to lie on us. If you cry out to him, if you surrender your life, if you're willing to lay down your sin, he will forgive you. To love in Jesus. Not sodomy, not perversion. Not homosexuality. True love is only in Christ. Amen. Amen. How you doing, brother? Yeah, God bless you. Don't you want to have peace? Amen. Amen. You're with us. You're with us. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you want to have love? If it gets, Don't you want to have true crazy, joy? You need to get closer. Get, you know, there is no peace on this back the side wicked. Right here, so if it gets crazy, because it'll get busy. There's no right? peace it'll in your sin. But yeah, yeah. If you want to stand beside the Lord, he will. Yeah, whenever, you wherever you are. want. That's it. God's hand has reached out to you today. You can be saved. You can be a child of God. The Bible says. The Bible says. Amen. He who commits sin for the devil. For the devil has sinned from the beginning. For this purpose, the Son of God was manifested that he might destroy the works of the devil. Jesus came to destroy the sin in your life. He's unstable. Give your life to him. I don't think he's going to do anything. But he Give your life to Christ. Turn away from your homosexuality before it is your work, before you get danced in the devil's hell. I got another camera in the car, I believe, that, uh, that I'll put on you. God can set you free from that spirit of perversion and give you the Holy Spirit of God. God will give you power over all the power of the enemy, the devil. I am a witness of the true grace of God Amen. in which I stand. Right. The grace of God does not leave you in your sin. The grace of God that saves you, empowers you not to be a homosexual. Amen. Not to be a, a porn addict. Amen. Our family, our families are being destroyed. Our communities are being destroyed. Our children are being destroyed because we did not obey God. We did not obey the word of God. Amen. Jesus said, you should fear God, who after has killed the body, has power to cast both body and soul in hell. Amen. Hell is not a party. Hell is eternal torment. Weeping, wailing, gnashing your teeth, weeping, wailing, 
gnashing your teeth where the wrath of God is poured out upon these enemies without measure. Amen. That means as much wrath as he can pour on you, it'll be that. Without mixture, the wrath of God will be poured out on you. Right now, you are experiencing the goodness of God. His oxygen, his earth, his clouds, his sun, and he even owns you. The Bible says, the soul of the Father is mine. And the soul of the Son is mine. And the soul who committed sin shall die. That's what God says. God made you to be a man. You be a manly man. Quit being a homo. Quit being a bad example to your kids. Shame on you. You ain't no loving person. You're sending your kids to hell. God's face is against those who do evil. Amen. God's face is against those who do evil. You're cursed by God. You need to start to see me again. Yeah. It will not end well for you if you continue down this path. Turn to Jesus. Yes. He died for your sin. Yes, thank you, Lord. He was tortured. Kids, you kids, 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 do not believe that homosexual is a sin. I came out homosexual. You must be born again. Jesus. 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 That's what God gives you a new spirit. Jesus. That's what God gives you a new heart. No more bondage to sin. No more bondage to sin. Amen. Amen. Because it's not funny games Amen. until you wake up in hell. Don't listen to your mom. Your mom. You have to have a mom and a dad. Remember, a mom and a dad. The Read the Bible. Remember, kids, Read the Bible. 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 The book of Proverbs says. Adam and Eve. Amen. 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 Amen.
empowered by the Holy Amen. Ghost. That's what it means to be saved. He gives you the Holy Ghost so Amen. that you can be obedient to His commandments. You can't stop porn because you don't have God. Amen. You can't stop. You can't stop being a homosexual without God. Amen. He has to break the chain. Jesus has to break the chain of sin in your life. Cry out to Him. Amen. Surrender your whole life in service to Him. Amen. Because it's not loving to support your son when he's a homosexual. You need to tell him to repent. God made you to be a man. You marry a woman. You live for God. You have God received. You teach them the Bible. Amen. That's what blessed people do. Yes, really. I'm an ex to save me. You need to repent You don't know God the Bible. Repent. Beware. Oh, hypocrisy. Hypocrisy is when you say you love God and you're a Christian, but you don't obey Him. True Christians obey the Bible. Amen. Jesus said, if you love me, keep my commandments. Amen. If you love me, keep my Commandments! You're leading yourself to hell. Real quick. You're leading yourself to hell. You're leading your community to hellfire. Do you not fear God? Do you not fear God? He's giving your heart beating. He's giving you a little bit of time to repent before the return of His Son, Jesus Christ. Amen. Come on. He's coming back to slay the wicked. Great. He's coming back to exact vengeance upon the evil doer. He's a God of judgment. A God of justice. A God of mercy if you repent. Amen. Going up in hellfire. But fools make a mock at sin. Amen. On that day, you will not be mocking God. Amen. On that day, when you stand before Him, you will not be able to say anything. In the book of Proverbs, it says that God will cut out the tongue of the wicked. Amen. God's going to cut your tongue out if you're blaspheming His name. OMG is called blasphemy. Yes, it is. The very God who gives you breath. The very God who gave you life, you use His name as a curse word. And the Bible says all those who do such things will not go unpunished. You will not go unpunished. Your time of mercy is only for a little bit, old man. You better get right with God and teach your children the ways of God. Amen. So they're not destroyed. The Bible says this is the love of God that we keep His commandments. And His commandments are not burdensome. God's commandments are not hard to keep once you get born again. Amen. It says, He that commits sin is a slave of sin. And a slave will not abide in God's house forever. But a son will abide forever. Everyone supporting this will be destroyed. Everyone supporting homosexuality will be destroyed unless you repent. Amen. God will give you natural affections. If you're a woman, He'll give you affections for a man. He'll make you straight. He'll make the crooked things straight. He'll get that spirit of homosexuality out of you. You're going to die early because of your evil ways. And it's appointed for man once to die. But you don't have to. You don't have to die early. From the judgment. After this life, you will be judged by a holy and righteous.
righteous God. God created you not to be destroyed. He created all I men to be I'm saved. Take the day is coming! Jesus' is blood is the only way we love, we love. you can be forgiven or you will surely burn in hell. You will surely be punished in hell for this evil wickedness. Documenting your feed here. <laughs> I'm an ex The wicked shall be turned into hell. And all nations shall forget God. Why don't you just stand right here instead of up on my guy? Isaiah 128. Just stand the right here. The sinners and transgressors will be destroyed together. Okay. Guy's in the street. He's in the street. You better turn to Jesus while you still can. You better get saved, sanctified, and filled with the Holy Ghost. Because Jesus is your only hope. If you're standing for this sin, you're already damned. The Bible says you're already condemned. Because you have not believed. In the name of the only begotten Son of God. You haven't believed in Him. That's why you're still in sin. Because you don't truly believe. The Bible says the just shall live by faith. And if anyone draws back, my soul has no pleasure in Him. But we are not of those who draw back to perdition. We are those who believe to the saving of the soul. Amen. You have to believe to the saving of your soul. Repent of your evil ways. Dayton, Ohio.